even, oh my goodness. Hello, today we're gonna film a video of if you boil things, what happens to it when you boil it completely. We did a video of this and it got disgusting. Whole milk is disgusting. So this time we have 2% milk, some orange soda, some alcohol beer, Starbucks lattes, kombucha, and some Orbeez, all right? So we're gonna pour all these, we're gonna boil it, and we're gonna see how they are in the end. How do I do this? How do I open? I don't know how to open beer. I don't drink beer. All right, I think this is how you do it. Ready? All right. Okay, we're gonna pour this here. Wow. Is that what beer looks like? That's crazy. All right, we're gonna pour some orange soda here. All right. 2% milk. Let's see how you turn out. We got some Starbucks, okay? What do you really put in your body when you go to Starbucks and ask for a lattes? Just like that. And then we got the mocha frappuccino. We're gonna put it in the same one because they're the same thing. Next up, we got kombucha, all right? Kombucha is the new vibe, okay? New trend, it's been a while for a while. But how good is it? Let's see what's in it. See, you see that strand? That is the, I guess a little kombucha root or whatever, I don't even know what that is, but I know they put roots in there. Eh, it's delicious, don't get me wrong. I love kombucha, but it's just crazy to see that. Last but not least, Orbeez. What really is in Orbeez? You can hear him scream already. Whoa! They're screaming. All right, so let's let this sit for a couple while and uh, I'll come back to you. All right, current update, it's been about seven minutes. Um, as you can see, the beer, it's uh, foamy. I could say it's just foamy. I mean, nothing too unusual, it's still boiling. The Fanta, um, same thing here, uh, nothing too crazy. But if you look at here, the milk, you can see a top layer starting to form. Can you see that? Can you see that? You can see it like pulsating over there. It kind of looks very weird. Oh, oh. Dang, even 2% milk has, look at that. 2% milk still has a layer of uh, this nasty. That's weird. Dang. All right, moving on to the Frappuccino here. Oh, even this one. Oh. Oh. Even that one, not as like crazy as the other one, but like it still has a top layer. That is wild. This one, the thing that was floating has now sunk into the bottom. So kombucha is looking good. It's still, some of them are tiny. I wanna see if they can get, oh, some of them are like cracking. Like, as you can see, like, like they're breaking in half by itself. I guess they can't stand the heat. All right, so that's the update. I'll see you guys when something else happens. All right guys, it's been about another 10 minutes. And check this out, the beer is uh, it's pretty much evaporated pretty quickly. I mean, there's really nothing left. I mean, I was expecting like some kind of like pus or some like, I don't know, some random gunk or whatever, but it's all right. I'm not saying to drink beer, I'm just saying, I'm just, I'm just, just kind of surprised here. Fanta, um, I feel like uh, it'll get there eventually. All right, but once again, 2% milk, okay? Um, look at that, look at this. Look at the milk. Ooh, oh, see? I expected this from whole milk, but 2% milk? I was expecting like not too much, but that, this is what you put in your body whenever you eat milk. Drink milk. This is why you fart so much. This is why I fart so much, because of the bat. Okay, Starbucks, same thing here, except this one is like, Chocolate flavored, all right? So I guess this is like the fat. This is the fat in the milk. So uh, yeah, that's what happens when enzymes. And then this, the kombucha, nothing yet. I mean, I'm, I'm really excited to see what happens like at the end, but you see, oh yeah, let me try to see if I can get that weird. I don't know, I don't know what that is, a ginger root? Or maybe, I don't know, bacteria? People say bacteria, so people, it's probably bacteria. The Orbeez have shrunken in size, for sure. Look at that. 
so nothing too crazy here. I think we're gonna turn this one off because I don't think the Orbeez are gonna do anything else than that. So uh, yeah, stay tuned for another update. Uh, this milk and this coffee, very interesting to see. So see you guys in a bit. All right, update. It's been about just five minutes, but hey, I was right. The beer turned out really weird. Look at this. So I was right. So the gunk in the beer, okay, that, that's, this is what I was expecting. Oh, you see? That is crazy. Oh my goodness. Let me just, look at that. That is what happens when you boil beer. Whoa. Oh my goodness, it's crunchy. It's not even burnt. That's, wow. Oh my goodness. Let me just scrape off the rest so you can clearly see what I'm seeing here. Oh, look at that. That looks like crazy earwax or some, some like, if like a tarantula just died or so. Ooh. Hey, we're filming. Hey, we're filming. What does that even taste like? Whoa, that's nasty. That's what happens when you, oh my goodness. You can literally just scrape off the rest, like. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Surprise, surprise. Oh, even, oh my goodness. Okay, so the Fanta, okay, if you ever wonder what happens when you boil orange soda, it becomes like, kind of like jello-like. Look at that. Um, that is probably, I, I don't know if I could, I don't know if that's good or bad, but the thing about this is if you let it cool down, it'll eventually solidify. Look at this, look at that. Okay, we're gonna wait for this to, okay, we're gonna wait for that to cool down. I want you guys to see it. Okay, but in the meantime, oh my goodness, check out the milk. See, what is that? Is that just burnt or what? Look at that. You see the bubbles just like going like weird. Oh, oh. Look, this is what happens when you, even 2% milk has this. Like whole milk had the same thing. I feel like it's the same thing. So wonder what would happen if we try fat free milk. Oh my gosh, look at that. That is like, it's like a fish. I literally like scooped up like a living fish. Ugh. Same goes for here. Next time you go to Starbucks or whatever, grab some coffee. It's not as bad as regular milk, but I think, oh, it's okay. Yeah, that's fine. I mean, it's okay, I guess. Like, look. Okay, we still gotta wait on that. Kombucha, how you doing over here? Yeah, kombucha's looking good. I mean, nothing too gunky just yet. We gotta wait until it like boils completely. Cause we didn't see what happened to the beer until the end. That was crazy, so. But like I said, <laughs> once this hardens, it literally just hardens into like a very like candy-like substance. Um, the reason why I'm, I believe it's like this, cause the sugars, the sugars make this. Oh, it's not bad. Oh. Check this out, so sticky. Oh my goodness. All right, so let's check out the final remaining thing. So as expected, 2% milk, nasty. Oh, oh, look at all these holes. Does that trigger you? Hmm? Oh, okay, yes, just like that. All right, guys, here we go. 2% milk, anybody? Mmm, yummy. Oh, coffee doesn't look as bad. It's just the bottom layer. That kind of looks like the top layer. And then we have excess stuff. But honestly, if I boil everything, it's probably gonna be just like this brown piece right there. So that's nasty. And then kombucha. I don't even know what happened. It just looks like syrup now. Let me see if I could, uh... Whoa, this is just a weird, just, I don't even know what this is. 
Whoa, now it just became like this paste. Oh, there it is. You see that um, bacteria thing that was like floating around earlier? It's right here. That is, oh. Hmm, smells weird. All right, so what did we learn here? We learned that the best drink for you is probably water. Stay juicy.